Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's CTL Tech Explainer. Ever heard of a skateboard chassis? The concept dates back to 2002, when General Motors first introduced it as a way to integrate the power system, suspension, and battery into a flat, modular platform. This design changed how vehicles were built. The manufacturing process was then divided into two parts. The chassis focused on power and safety, while the body concentrated on styling and user experience, and both could be developed in parallel. As electric vehicle technology advanced, battery, motor, and electronic control system became increasingly important, and the skateboard chassis has taken on a new role in this transformation. As experts in battery technology, CTL has been exploring how to better integrate batteries with chassis systems since 2018. This has led to the creation of our groundbreaking CPC technology. Here's the CETL's Bedrock Chassis. It's a perfect example of CTC innovation. In the past, EV batteries were built step by step. Our CTP technology eliminated the need for modules, integrating cells directly into the battery pack. What about CTC? We've gone even further. No battery packs, no modules. The cells are now directly integrated into the chassis, becoming part of the vehicle structure. This has helped us to achieve the volume efficiency of over 75%. This creates more flexible use of space. We can accommodate more battery cells. Traditionally, a chassis could only hold a 100 kWh battery pack, but now it can hold 110 kWh or even 120 kWh translating to longer driving ranges. If more range is not preferred, we can simply use less space to house the same quantity of battery cells. This can then be combined with inverted cell technology, in which we merge the thermal runaway space above the cells with the buffer space below the cells, making even better use of space. These add 20 to 30 millimeters of interior height. No matter how tall the passengers are, they don't need to worry about bumping their heads. Instead, they can sit comfortably with a better view. And we don't stop there. We have also worked to optimize the front to back space. Most of the vehicles today have extremely limited seating space in the third row, largely due to difficulty in balancing the layout of the rear electric drive units and the cabin space. By highly integration of the rear EDU into the chassis, and with a rear-mounted motor layout, we have freed up the room in the cabin. For a mid-size SUV with a 2960mm wheelbase, this adds 130mm of the leg room in the third row. This makes the third row generally more comfortable for passengers. No more complaints when sitting in the back. Let's take the CTL Bedrock chassis outside and show you how it works in action. State-of-the-art technology, perfect performance. Just imagine taking this out on road for real. That's all for today's video. Thank you for watching. Stay curious and keep powering forward.